Suicide Hill. It always had that name? Yeah, it always had this name. And like, it's crazy because people would come from Yonkers, people would come from Mount Vernon, and they all call it the same thing, Suicide Hill. They call it Suicide Hill because if you ride your bike all the way up there from Matilda Avenue, coming straight down, and do not have, even if you had brakes, you weren't supposed to use your brakes. You don't got no brakes. And you keep on going straight down all the way. And if you look at Suicide Hill from up there, you can't see it. We're gonna jump this shit. It's a wild decline. Yeah, Julian and I are turning so right, rap. Even from like right here, you can't see the bottom of that hill. Right, so that's a wild decline. That's legendary Sui. That's Sui. If you wanna lose your life, meet up here with your bike, skateboard, rollerblades. It's, it's, it's a wrap. There's nobody, there's nobody out here watching for no kids either. Exactly. So, so if you take an hour, you're gonna yeah. be in It is what it is. Yeah, right there by the two train. Does, does that count as uptown? That's yeah. uptown. Yeah, it's uptown. Yeah. Two train? Come on. That's right at the, right the Burke and Alex. That's about the Yeah, so you uptown, yeah. you Come bro. On. I sit over there for a minute. Nah, White Plains Road is like. Uh, White Plains Road is a, uh, it's a blessing, bro. Like, I wouldn't be who I am if going into White Plains Road. Um, not to put in, not to put in um, on this purse, but even the, you know, the violence and the aggression and the treatment, um, is like was as well appreciated because it made me who I am, stronger, you know what I mean? Like competitive. Like, you know, I grew up on 238th Street and then you got 233rd, 241st, and you got 228th Street, 226th Street, 219th Street, 211th Street. Like, and everybody kind of competitive. If we were to find ourselves in a different place, we would fight for each other. But when we find ourselves in the same place, we fight <laughs> each other. <laughs> like, <laughs> decision when you get them nutcrackers, B. What you say? I was thinking of rum punch, but I don't want a taste. Watermelon right here. Watermelon hit? Watermelon hit? All right, I get the watermelon. Got the watermelon. <laughs> So we just pulled up on the spot. Oh, what's the score? What's the cross street? 234 and Bronx Boulevard. Yeah, Bronx 234 and Bronx Boulevard. To get at that the jerk minutes. truck. Ooh. Oh. Show them what's up. Let's get a close up of that joint. Look wow. how it shines like gold. Now when she asked you what you wanted, like I told gold. you, oh. I told you, yeah, no. it's on you. So how, how, how did how did they how did they finesse it? Right, so the thing is, with jerk chicken, um, one of the top things is sauce. Like sauce is important. So they gonna ask you what type of sauce you want in it. You know what I mean? You have barbecue sauce, you can put ketchup sauce, but jerk sauce is the sauce. It's the special sauce. Yeah. So it's like, like for me in particular, like if the jerk chicken ain't spicy. That's barbecue chicken. You feel me? Right, right. It has to be spicy. But some people like they drink chicken sweet, and some people like yeah. I got the baby lunch. So yeah. I, got the, you know, I can't. I can't go too hard. You so know what I, mean? I act for the jerk sauce and then the barbecue sauce to make it a little sweet. All right, you know what right, I mean? right, right, right. But look at that. Wow. Yeah. So why do you call it jerk chicken? I I don't really know why they call it jerk chicken, but I can tell you, hi, right, because you know a lot a lot of people already know like uh, uh, my family is Jamaican. You know, this is my family right here. And um, so the, the story about jerk chicken, it comes from the Maroons, right? The Maroons were like slaves that ran away um, when Jamaica was dominated by Spain. 
I believe, Portugal. One of them. I actually start from like they, they before they had grills and stuff. It yeah. Was like pimento sticks. They used yeah, to like they use pimento sticks, and, the, and that's important All from the pimento sticks yeah. because what the stick would do, it would like soak up the juice. You know what I mean? And they would reuse the ferment, use these sticks, reuse the, the stick because the flavor is in the stick. And you know what I mean? And, and that's how the jerk chicken like has this uh, kind of like nice burnt, like it's the best burnt food. <laughs> I made my first jerk chicken story, right? So <laughs> I, got, I got family in Crown Heights, right? So I'm in Crown Heights by Utica with my cousin Sean. What up, Sean? So, so Sean, my first time, he's like, yo, you about to eat jerk chicken for the first time. Don't play yourself. Get water. Don't eat the skin over here. <laughs> the skin is hot. Just eat the chicken. Drink water. You be all right. That's so, the season is. Exactly. Right, right now, but he's like, right. he's talking, but he's talking, I'm not ready for the skin. I'm like, I'm ready for the skin. We talking, I'm ready for the skin. And I'm getting a tropical fantasy. I'm not getting the water. He's like, he's like, you're retarded. So I'm like, now nah, I'm doing my thing. I go straight for it. I bite right into it. Immediately, I knew I played myself. I then I went, I went for the blue, the I went for the blue pop, the worst soda ever, 50 cent. I went through that back, ah, only makes yeah. it worse. I didn't even have no tongue, I didn't feel no tongue. I'm wait, drinking no. water, I mean, wait, I'm no. putting cocoa bread that back. I mean, it's working. I, yeah, I, I, yo, that was some good jerk chicken, nigga. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I need to get this joint right here. Mm, yeah. Wow. Big boy piece. That one got the spice, I can see the refining on it. And this is what we do, they get so much chicken and yo, all you need, all you need is chicken bread, bread, some hard dough bread, it's gotta be real soft. And maybe another cracker. Yeah, hold up, that's not Wonder Bread. Yeah, no, that's not Wonder Bread. This is the kind of bread you get at the Jamaican store. See how it just fell off, it's not look, nothing that good. Oh, look, it's, it's hitting me now, hold on. I'm born in Jamaica, this shit is killing me, my nigga. This shit is real. I ain't got no spicy one, boy. Nah, I'm getting the, 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 the delayed hit right now. Woo! I might not be built, you know? This is fantastic. I know this is my fix. That was good. about the flavor, though, you yeah. Wow. That was it. That was the step curry shot. And they slow roasting it, so yeah, like, look. my plate empty. Wow. wow. <laughs> Homies, if that... Zing not playing that. no games, you nah, hungry, my nah. nigga. Nah. Yo, this is LeBron James dunk right here. This is this. Good. So they probably been cooking this for how many hours? Because it, it, just, it just kicked off now. It's like seven. Yeah, yo, how long does it take to make drink? It take a while, man. Yeah. You gotta do the simmer. You gotta let it simmer. You gotta let it soak properly. Not just burn. You gotta soak properly. That's why that's falling off the bone like that, though. Yeah. Wow. How long you been rapping? Yeah. Me? I've been rhyming since I was, since like, PS16. I was like a third Shout out to PS school. Yeah, that's how you know you've been doing it for a minute. You shout, you shout out your, your public school, your yeah, elementary school. Yeah, my elementary school. Yeah, PS16. Well, my composition notebook is where it started at. Right, exactly. Not paying attention in class. Right, right, none of us was. We still made it though. Shout out to that system that was pushing us up. No child left behind. We got the super talented, super lyrical Mr. Porter with us right now. And he's rapping. Like his lyrics. I mean, he's spending time. He's cooking it up. Like this jerk chicken, it's sitting in the barrel. It's simmering before it hits you. It don't just hit you like, you know, it's not microwave. So, you know, what, what, what's, you know, what's inspiring you? What's influencing you to rap the way you rap? You know, to be honest, I don't think I do it on purpose, you know. I think it's all I know. I think that's that's what rap is. I think what, what's happening is like rap is changing around me. So it's like uh, it's like I shine as much as uh, the more it changes, the more I shine. The more people start lacking in certain directions, I'm just elevating because this, this is what I know. This is the type of hip hop. Right, 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 right. You know what I mean? So I don't really like call it like like holding it down for this type of style or this, it, this is what I do, like this is how I rap, this is how I do. Boju, yeah, Boju is like, you know, he's coming home soon, but he's, yeah, he's one of my favorite writers of all the time. Him, Edgar Allan Poe, Tupac. Um, I'm gonna say Edgar Allan Poe. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of Respect. out of the box with it, man. Like, I, yeah, like you know, but, and writing is what I do, you know what I mean? I just use music to express my passion, but writing is my passion. So, it's 
a lot of like controversy. People talking about beef patties from different sources and whatnot. Is y'all rocking with pizzeria beef patties or is done for that? No, that's patties. dead. I was just I was Bakery! Yo, I've never ate a beef patty from a pizzeria. <laughs> no, no, no. Beef patty with cheese, no. Paul's Bakery, right up the block, B. Oh shit, Paul's, yeah, Paul's Bakery. <laughs> yo, he forgot, yeah. yo, he forgot yeah, where he came from. He forgot where he came from. They got the softest patties, yo. They got the softest patties. Now switching up, now he's switching up. Yo, Dixon Bakery is the way. Dixon Bakery got, 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 yo, their patties is ignorant. But <laughs> I go right here first. I have to I have to walk past Paul in order to get over there. So I fell in love with them first. So it's so quiet. It's super quiet. It's pizzeria is done. No it's super quiet for pizzeria. Around, around, around Even here. Golden Crest is like McDonald's. Ooh, like, nah, let me stop joking. Nah, it's too late. Nah, I, I, nah, I ain't joking. I ain't joking. Nah, go, nah, go, it's go, go bakery to or, or 238. That's where right. it's at. That's it. Kingston or Paul's right there. Golden Crest, what? Don't listen to none of them. Back in the day, they was eating all that shit. Well, I'll be, well, I'll be patty with the cheese. I'm not gonna lie, sir. Be patty with the cheese with the Fine. pepperoni. Fine. You know what I'm saying? When you hungry, you know what I'm saying? I know, I get it. I respect the authenticity of it. Yes, yes, yes. But, We're on our but these niggas was eating. You, you, you ate at least a thousand of them joints. Listen, I know what I mean. But I respect the King's Bakery Post. Like they said, if you want the real, real beef patty, you gotta go to Jamaica. You don't care about your tongue at all. You wanna let that thing burn on? There's no other patty like that, you know what I mean? I don't know.